What's going on, this is Johnny, and welcome back to episode number 16 of the oh, just enjoying a GTA 5 dispute. campaign. See, we're about to do something really, really bad. So I need to present myself as a proper textile magnet, so... so you still oh, What's going on, this is Johnny, and welcome back to GTA 5. This is going to be episode number 16. And we have the heist to do. We just did the heist setup last episode, so we are going to be starting it off real strong. And doing it. We'll talk to hey, Lester. How you doing? Ah, pretty good under the circumstances. About to knock off a federal government building. Oh, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. And probably just Friend came back. Got us what we need. Put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. So, I'm guessing drapes and scented candle aren't gonna do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. You'll have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get out, trigger the bomb. The illegal this is. Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, mm -hmm. I got it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well... Under the circumstances, <clears throat> it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. All right, go to the FIB building. Oh, my God, I can see my atrocious wheels from in, in here. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and go there. <clears throat> Call Franklin. Oh, we're gonna make it. Oh my god. Is it happening? The deal is, I'm about to go in as a janitor. I need you to grab Daryl Johnson, Hugh oh. Welsh, and wait on my word in the fire truck. All right, man, I'll round them up. Would have been kind of good to have some experience on board, but whatever, man. Call us when you're on your way out. You got it, boss. And the FIB building go to the turn, turn style. There's something going on. What kind of car bomb it sounds like? All right, can I go in here like this? You knew? Just go through the turnstile. Right, here we go. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. <laughs> go to the elevator. <clears throat> you would think that they would know who I am. You know? But maybe not. All I gotta do is just act like a janitor. Okay. Maintenance closet. Pick up the mop. Nice. Everything's going to plan. Go to the office floor. Mop the floor. Drop the bucket. There we go. A to clean the floor. Okay. Crap. Clean the mop in the bucket. Clean it. Man, this would get so annoying. Oh, really? I got one little spot I gotta clean? Nice. Plant the bomb in the lock. The dude there. There you go. 
All right. Here the bucket. Nothing to see here. Just mopping, doing my duty. Okay, go to the next room. Right here. Oh my god, I have so many places to go. Put this in the middle. Okay. Nice. I don't think I can do two. I think I gotta do one, and then I gotta, like, clean it. Ah, shit. Yep. Absolutely. Alright. Oh my god, I picked it up like an idiot. Put it back down. <clears throat> nice. Okay. Go ahead and clean it, and then we'll go to the next one. Put this up. Got two more in this area. This is the part of the game. I'll I'd, I'd cut this out, but I mean, this is like what we gotta do. So, I like to make sure that things are like actually worth watching, you know. But this, this is what you have to do. So, Another part of the janitor? mission. Was the last one a heart attack or a budget cut? <laughs> you so when funny. You get out of here when I log my OT for the week. Yeah, it's not about being effective, it's about seeming to be effective. I think go this way. Vectors on a graph, man. Do I? Yeah, limiting civilian freedom is a great substitute to actually doing anything. Long may it continue. Oh, it's a here. Okay, okay, okay. Sure. I didn't see that. Did not know that. My bad. Hey, hey! Wait till I shake it off before you mop the floor. Act like we're doing something. Okay. This one. Perfect. Pick up the bucket. Back to the closet. Can I just go the same way? Hope so. Alright, so far so good. Jeez. See ya, lady. Well, you might not be here anymore, because one of the bombs is right there. You might not be going home. Leave the building. <clears throat> Nothing to see here. We just chillin'. They don't work so hard. We're all leaving in a minute. Right, right, right. Yeah, you would think they would do like some kind of other thing to make sure no one's got bombs and whatnot, you know? My dumb looking car. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Hey, here we go. 
Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Shit's in motion, people. We raiding the bureau. Y'all ready for this? <laughs> I'm gonna trust this plan is good, because I usually get brought in earlier. This is about to, this is weird. Detonate the incendiaries, Frank. I'll get this turnout gear on. Okay, use a funnel to detonate the C4. Is that cottonate? All right, yeah, there you go. Cottonate. I didn't say contact, but I, just, I read detonate, so I put it together. Nice. And up she goes. Okay, here we go. This is where the real stuff happens. Just so do what we gotta do and signal, right? yep. go from there. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess, so don't worry. Oh, damn it. Well, I'm an idiot and didn't go at the freaking thing. Here we go. <clears throat> Hold it up there by the curb. Alright, let's get in there. Enter the FIB building. This is so cool. I'm assuming we gotta use the stairs, right? Oh, this is a this isn't freaking safe at all. Alright, Lester says these elevators should still be fine. Was he on that industrial strip painkillers or that hallucinatory weed at the time? Yeah, probably a little bit of both. Cool, dog. Thanks for clearing that shit up. <laughs> we gotta go across. Take the stairs to the top floor. Alright, we're going across to the far stairwell and up to the top floor. Alright, let's go. I got a bunch of randoms with me. I'll let them kind of go first. We take these up six stories. Server room's on 53. Keep going. Almost at the top. I'm really, I can't go as fast as these guys. These guys are, or I can't go any slower. Like, in my way. Should've went for got past one. Ah, yep. I know this is a weird angle right now, but I got a, I'm using We're on the the all my hands here. Okay, I'm with you. Come on, Mike. Oxygen's still good. Oh, Mike, out of the building. We ain't got long. Follow me. I can't die here. Let's go. Oh, my God. Oh, people. Oh, They're coming down. Come on. We got shit to do. The door won't budge. Pick it down. Okay, I was gonna throw, I was gonna, I was gonna throw a thing. Oh! Yeah. Jesus. Franklin, see if you can get Welsh up on his feet. Help up you, Welsh. Ah, oh, shit, man. He's dead. Oh my god. I don't think so. No, we ain't. We good. I'm right behind you, boss man. Oh! Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. 
Oh my god, I'm by myself. What? What? What I'm saying? Why are you guys shooting at me? Go get out of here. Bunch of weirdos. We gotta go left or right here. I don't give a fuck who you are. Just get out of here. You fool should be at home. Stay done, man. I'm coming to find you. Awesome job. Hurry up. 50th floor, man. Almost with you. It's Frank. Go, come on, come on. You got it. Let's go. Go to the elevator shaft. Why are there freaking FIB agents up top? They're just playing with their lives at that point. Alright, this is our way out. We gotta get these doors open. Watch out! Hey, give me a hand! Briggs! Come on! I see it's tree level! Okay. Use L to append hold X to send in. Oh my god, that is insane. That was close, dog. Now let's go. Here it comes, here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Ooh, shit, it missed us. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got this. Wait, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait, 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 now. Boom. One more time, should do it. Hold on, wait. There it goes. And now. Please and thank you. Get in the truck. Well, leave the building and get to the fire truck. How, how do they know that we weren't firemen? Like, what gave it away? Especially when they're outside, like in the front front door. Like, what? It's also kind of suspicious that Take us to the getaway car. that the firemen are leaving. They wouldn't leave a scene like this, you know. So I don't know. Just the my the my input. All right, we all gotta change before we get there. At some point soon, an APB will go out looking for firemen. We cannot be playing dress up when that happens. We need to get to the ride and torch this fire truck as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute, they'll be looking for us. I mean, those guys in the building you took down. If they knew, who else is going to know? It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Trust me. I'm going to get us there as fast as I can. All right, shit. Shit. I just don't want to run into something. Man, y'all don't want to run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't want to run into. Oh, shit. You know what I just realized? So, uh, Get out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. They're right, dirt. Try. try real hard, okay? Oh my god, I don't know how I'm supposed to get over there. It's underneath us, not on top of here. Here we go. Perfect. 
we are out of here. I can probably tell you people. I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a dude, man. Oh, yeah, shit. There's a word for it, isn't there? Oh, what is it? Oh, yeah, Darwinism. Oh, that could have been any of us. It's just luck it wasn't you. It wasn't luck that saved me. It was brains. <sighs> All right, man, if that's what you think. Well, anyway, we made it out, so we got that to be thankful for. Hugh's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Yeah, man, unfortunately, Hugh wasn't really cut out for this work, man. His mind was on other things. Why you say that? Man, he told me he was writing a screenplay. Did he give you a copy? I'd like to read it. Why? Well, you forget. I'm in the business. This guy gets killed in a raid on the Bureau and we produce his picture? There's some free press. They call that, uh, pre-awareness. Yeah, all right, man. Sure. How very fine wood. Hey, let's the place up here. Perfect. Nice. Yeah, <laughs> it was my pleasure. <laughs> well, what? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! Ah! Fucking A Ray, we oh, did it! Ah! Ow! How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, give me oh. some of that. Ow, 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 ow. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. <laughs> hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm oh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> <coughs> man, that's some foul ass shit! Oh. <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I gotta go square things up with Davy and Dick uh, For serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it's not gonna happen. Go with you, dog? No, stay, have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I wanna put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you boys sure know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis. Jesus Christ. The B roll raid. All right. Let's go ahead and call Dave. We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly? It doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck. Okay. Where am I going here? Way up here, huh? And they really like to make you drive across the freaking entire continent. Oh yeah, it's not a continent at all, actually. It's a freaking state. City. Anyway, I'll be back. I'm gonna go ahead and drive there and, you know, do what I gotta do. Man, this is ridiculous. This is like a 45 minute thing just to get to the dude. And then left. And he's right over here. Ah, see? David, that's why we're such great friends, huh? We're old school. We like old fashioned things. Like newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. 
There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy, you could say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but- I'm fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Steve, oh, Steve, whoa! On, please! You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him, not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Who the fuck are you with? With me. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the, the weapons down. Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Boys, put the gun down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather! What Merriweather. are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down. Oh, same goddamn leg! Go! Fuck! Oh my god! Mike, this your frequency. Um, do you not realize that we have... Alright. The There's a bunch of people here, so give me another. Oh god, here we go. Ooh, Trevi! Woo wee! That's what I'm talking about. Trevor always comes and saves us. Anyone's gonna kill you, old friend! It's gonna be me! Oh! You here to finish the job, T? No, 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 I'm just here for the opportunity! Now run! <laughs> Fucking T, man. But I'm about to get jumped by a team of rogue agents. T, you got the vantage point. Give Dave a hand. This is Oops. the guy who iced Brad. God damn it. And would I me? I'd be better off putting my sights on him. Hands made it out of here. And there's another group of agents looking into our shit. Man. Right now, you're not in a position to let our only friend in the bureau get killed. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Looks clear. D, make a play for that stone. All right. I always said I'd check out the court center. I don't think this is the way that you wanted it to go, though. Is the thing. Of course. Got him. Mercenaries here. Oh shit. So tell me, Davy, who are these bureau men trying to kill me? My question is, how the hell did they get in here? Oh, these guns. I like how did my. You were the corrupt division. Lots of you up there. What happens to Haynes? Norton gonna pop him at the water cooler on Monday? I'm not popping Steve. Jesus. I'll get close to him and I'll try to control him. That's if we get out of here alive. Over here! I'm coming. I can only go so far. What are Merriweather doing at this party? You tell me. You're the one hitting their planes, trains, and boats. You wanna come at someone? Shit, you've been in. Come at me. 
They're done! I gotta get out before someone clocks my chopper. Hey! Thanks, T! This is our shot! I'm making a run for the parking lot! Get clear and we'll talk! Go up this way! We're receiving This fire. many bodies, there'll be cars in the lot! Put as much dirt between you and this place as you can! And do not contact me until you're absolutely sure you're clear! What a pansy! Listen, man, I gotta get out of here as fast as I can, too, so... Grab that guy! Grab that guy. This one's mine. Good luck. Mike, That's fine. I'm getting this one. We need to have a conversation. So conversate. Not here. Meet me behind the pawn shop in Morningwood. Gray, another Let's chopper. Go. Lose the enemy chopper. Well, here, let me get in this fucking fast ass vehicle. How'd that go for you? Let me in this thing. There we go. Now we're freaking going in style. Woo wee! Let's go. Pull. We just gotta get the hell out of here. I wonder if I could just like leap off there. There is a security guard over here. Let's go. Worked out in our favor. We out. This freaking car is so cool. Nice. Smoking, huh? huh? Come on, man. No, no, no. That's bad for you, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor. Listen, I've been meaning. To... Uh, you know, I've been meaning. To... I've been meaning to tell you. You know, I've been. <laughs> what, homie? What have you been meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back. Or that you were, and always will be, a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, no, what the fuck, fuck did you day? come back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, no, no. One last score. Mm-hmm. And if it goes good, <laughs> guess what? I don't have to put a little bullet in your head. But if it goes bad, well, that's okay, too. Because then you and I get to go to hell. And I get to spend the rest of eternity with you tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester. Let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Ooh, we're all friends now. Suppose the group hugs out of the question? <laughs> he wants to, uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty. Depraved history. <laughs> but history, nonetheless. All right. There. You happy? Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. <laughs> Keep my eye on you. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. We'll hop in this freaking whip again. All right. So we got looks like we have a Franklin mission. Franklin. So we should probably I'm gonna hop in this car. God, this thing is so nice. Look at this thing, dude. Okay. Franklin? I will have a car like that one day. Period. Okay, where are we? 
Uh, let's see here, Franklin. Let's go inside Franklin's house here. Put the gun away. We ain't animals. All right. I mean, I'm real glad you're here. Come here. Uh, come I can't on. stay. What's up, babe? But it's Lamar. What that fool want now? It's your best friend. He's your best fucking friend. For real. My best friend. My homeboy, right? My nigga. Man, fuck you. I mean, not like that, man. But no, he ain't. He just another nigga from the hood. Him, stretching all the motherfucking clowns. All he want to do is drag a motherfucker down and live in the past. And this is the future? A big empty house with nobody who gives a fuck about you. Well, shit, it works for me. It can work for you, babe. I'm getting married, Franklin, to a doctor, not a murderer. Well, what the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm worried about Lamar. You got to help him, Franklin. Man, that shit is over. Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. You a phony fuck. What? I ain't saying you got to marry the fool. I'm saying he's about to get killed over that deal you and him put on with... Stretcher set him up. Oh, fuck, man. My whole fucking life I've been looking after this motherfucker and paying a price afterwards. Fuck. Well, at least do it one more time, Franklin, for me. For you? For you and your doctor? I love you and Lamar. We grew up together, but this life ain't for me, and you knew that. You ain't changing. They're marrying a doctor. I don't the care same how thing. many cars you own, how many apartments you own. I don't care how many diamonds you put in your ear. It ain't for me. Not done bad or done good. Babe, look, I'll change. No, you won't, and that's fair enough, but at least respect what you do, who you are. If you let that idiot die, you a bigger asshole than I thought. <sighs> Look, he's going up to some sawmill near Polito Bay. Ugh, you do what you got to do. All right, well. <sighs> Let's go get Lamar. Go to the sawmill. Hop in the whip. Five miles? Franklin, what's up? Hey, man. I'm in a bit of a bad situation. My boy Lamar got set up. I think he up near Polito Bay at some sawmill with some ballers. Could you, like, do some computer magic and look into it? Is that possible at all? It should be. I've got a back door into the Polito Bay police network left over from the score we did up there. Uh, give me a second here. Uh, hold on. Uh, yes. So what it say? Huh. Uh, this must be it. Uh, there are older reports of a weed operation being run by an African-American gang. Uh, the files got buried, so uh, I'm guessing they paid off the cops. They growing weed up there? Growing it in the hills, most likely, but they might be packing and shipping it out of this sawmill. I'd expect a fair few of them up there. Shit! And I'm gonna need some help. Can you tell Mike and Trevor to meet me up there? They still aren't getting along that well. Tell them it's for me, and it's serious. Thanks, man. All right, well, ho hopefully, uh, Mike and T can go up there, because if not, then, you know, we'll figure it out. I almost like do one of these. Ah, we're, we're, we're in GT. Oh, well, nailed it. That worked out. Friggin' dropped off like 0.4 miles there, just doing that. Oh, everybody's already here. Sweet. Why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, what y'all two shut the fuck up? Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. Place is crawling with ballas, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old gang warfare, but suede bucks over there. <laughs> yeah, tell Trevor I said bite me. Man, I said <laughs> shut up. Now I see the weed, but where the fuck is Lamar? Oh shit, there you go. There you go, there you go. You know what? Tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic, classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh fuck. Oh, we're going freaking balls he deep in this, huh? Fight, I run towards it. Go to any mark location to choose your assault path. I saw a few possible entry points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. Two, down the hill to my left. 
There's a bulldozer there. Might be able to use it in the assault. Three, the other uh, side from me. I'm going to be top. Should be possible to avoid the worst of it that way. But I won't be able to cover you. All right, thanks. Don't shoot and don't get too close. We don't want them to know we're here until they don't like we want them to know so. we're here. Uh, okay. You're the expert in springing attacks on the unsuspecting. I was gonna choose the one to the left here, but we have a light machine gun, so I figured this would be a little bit easier. Here's where I'm making my play. I'm going right at him. All right, my turn to move. Hey, I got a good vantage. I'll see what I can do up here when the time comes. I reckon our. Okay, we have two of them up here. Best shot is coming at him from two different directions. Okay. All right, I'll take that on board. I'm gonna go up this way then, I guess. We'll let, we'll let Trevor have the light machine gun going to the front, and then we'll come up to the left here. And, uh... See what we can get into. We'll probably just choose this one. It's the closest one. Right up here. Plus, we can still get cover from, uh... Find Lamar. Let's do the damn thing. Chicken hot, homie. Strap up. Hey, let's go. I'm coming for you. Where's the tall dude? Hey, got to move up. We'll go to the right here. They're coming hey, towards me, you huh? Lamar yet? No, no sign of him. Just guys wearing move. Lamar Davis wins. It's getting thick with him. Oops. Okay. I'm outnumbered over here. Bring out Lamar. We'll go away. Nice. Am I still not dead yet? There we go. We got one guy up to the top. It looks like there he is. Nice. Hey, these dudes are overweight and bulk. I'm surprised they ain't more of you. We got one more dude. Give us the mouthy one, and we'll be gone. Any news? You found him? see nobody else I literally don't all right oh I see him still one more Take 
Okay. Perfect, perfect. We got a little D. Better in love real quick. Where is he? There he is. Got him. Nice. I'm gonna take Lamar. Oh, it's right. just up I'm here, man. Too. Bye. Thanks. Is we ever gonna get a proper introduction, dog? Yo, is that All car right, up here still? Go. Go, 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 go. T, call me. Dog. Yo, let me let me get this one up, up here. To the and get horny on your office supplies. Uh. You're not coming, Trevor. All right. Shit, homie. You all right? I'm straight, homie. Bitches got to jump on me, though. How they get you to come all the way out here? Man, I ain't been let a little drive stand in the way of a money-making opportunity. Or get killed, opportunity. Man, you always a pessimist. Nah, nigga. A realist. Because in reality, all them fools want to clap your ass. Man, what a trust that, dog. I peeped out that wood chopping place when we was up this way on that Devin Weston car lit, which I mm -hmm. still ain't been paid for, incidentally. All secluded and shit. Stretch hit me up. I'm like, yeah, that's the perfect place to buy Kush by the busy. Nigga, perfect place to clap some fool you beefing with. Man, I ain't even know at the time. I just thought we was going to parlay. Parlay? Nigga, please. Every time you leave the house, fools try to clap you. Fools try to clap you. Every meet you set up, homies there for the express purpose of clapping your ass. Man, you show? Sure? Cause I'm sure there's been a few times when. No, I'm completely 100% sure. Every and not drive time, so nigga, fast. Whether you buying drugs, selling drugs, we could go off this thing so easy. Drugs. Talking about the weather or whatever. Man, these streets is hard, dawg. This is the hood you talking about. Maybe you forgot since you've been a uh, bettering yourself, sitting in that house on the hill, looking down on the. Nailed it. South Nailed it. Shit. Man, you know it ain't like that. Do I, my nigga? Because that's the way it looked to me. I'm making the best out of what I'm giving. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't in some type of mentorship program. The only mentor I got... And we gonna do something about that, dawg. Trust me. Man, I ain't got people teaching me that white-collar crime shit. Ain't shit changed for me, and you ain't helping. Ain't helping? What the fuck you call this? Me, Michael, Trevor, we all came up here to help the unholy fucking trinity. Always <laughs> beware when these fools rolling together. You jealous of Michael and Trevor? What happened to me and you fucking shit up? Form gangsters, nigga. So I should I shouldn't have called him, right? Man, I was doing everything in my power to make sure you wasn't clapped. I can make sure I ain't clap. Clearly you can't. Next time, homie, don't come. And as a matter of fact, if you do come, don't bring them dudes. Man, look, let's not talk next time. Next time, don't get your ass in the situation, all right? It's the hood, Frank. That's what happens in the hood. No, the fuck it don't. Not for everyone. I'm one of them dudes that it happens to. Man, you gonna tell me what was going on back there? Hood shit, homie. That's the shit that's different from the country club shit your overpaid ass is presently accustomed to. Man, stress put us on this shit, man. Man, we gonna get on his ass. Man, fuck that, homie. Look like I give a shit. Nigga, I give a shit. Stress do what he do. Niggas want me dead, be dead themselves. I ain't gonna overreact to shit. Overreact? Man, that nigga trying to listen to the story here. My fault, not talking. Nigga. nigga, that's the hood. I'm still here, ain't I? Just. You show stress knew they was gonna book me? Yeah, nigga, stress knew. Everybody knew stress knew. Tanisha knew stress knew, and she don't even come around the fucking hood no more. Damn, that nigga stress janky like that? Man, you don't see this? Man, stress been screwing us from the start. Like from back in the day? From like the other day, dawg. Since after we went to the recycling place and D and them ballers try to take us down. But stretch put in the work on D. Yeah, man, that's survival. Remember how angry his ass got? Especially with you bringing him into this shit? I, I, but tell me this, though. If Stretch was fucking with your boy LD, why he set us up with the deal for the brick in the first place? Y'all menace. He go off and make peace with the ballers, come back, 
and then put us on the lick on Grove Street. Man, you remember Grove Street? That brick was drywall. Ripping us off was probably stretches ideal anyway. Damn, you think so? It I makes think. sense, don't it? Man, I yeah. ain't know him, man, maybe. Man, Stretch got in with the ballers when he was inside. Played us as marks, dog, but a bunch of them got booked. So now they gotta come back at us. So Stretch sends you out there where they doing a the cush deal. Then you show up and save the day. Yeah, thankfully. Man, it wouldn't even be the same if your boy LD wasn't out here getting in the shit. And FC wasn't getting him out of it. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> man, I don't know. That shit was fun, nigga. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy scrapping like we did back in the day. It ain't back in the day no more, dog. But it felt like it was. Okay, fool. It was fun saving your useless ass one more fucking time. There you go. That wasn't too <laughs> There you go. You should have seen your face when I came in. You was like, shit, shit, shit. Hey, shit, man. Oh, bullshit, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> nigga. So I guess, I guess what we learned is, Nigga don't think it ain't no fun if he had fucking with the homies, nigga. You feel me, my nigga? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, uh, you know your nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something? You know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here in the set. Oh, shit, my nigga, that's nothing. Shit, yeah, nigga, I know you done went all Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying, leaving the street niggas at the back, but... Damn, man, uh, way to keep a nigga down, my nigga. I mean, thank you, I guess. Payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting them cars and shit, you know what I'm talking about? Give a nigga just enough money to get him a little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the poor house, huh? <laughs> Man, don't be like that, dawg. Cause number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. No matter how many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours to try to get us killed, I saved you, dawg. What are you supposed to, my nigga? I thought we was homies for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The best thing you can hope for is a big turn off of your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. What? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving your nigga in the backfield. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you would get some work. But instead, you want to be this game-banging, mad-dogging asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Card. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> nigga, who you think I am, nigga? <laughs> fuck you, Lamar. <laughs> nah, fuck you, F, nigga. I thought we was homies, nigga. But that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. You know what, dawg? If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dog. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in the turf, nigga. If you remember where that is. <laughs> oh. oh my God. What's up, player? Hello, Franklin. Man, I don't know y'all. We done. Hey, man. we ain't done yet, homie. Not yet. Nearly. Man, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill the president? Fuck his wife or something? Or invade some fucking country? No, no. Something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey. When the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out the pasture, oh me. Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Man, Trevor saved you. He saved both y'all asses. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. I'm not. Man, get Michael to do it. Me and Trevor cool, dawg. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. Not doing it, boss man. Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey, oh, flossing ass nigga. All right. Jesus Christ, man. All right, guys. This is gonna be episode number 16 of the GTA 5 campaign walkthrough. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and follow your friends. Also, guys, my name is Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode of GTA 5. We're really close to beating it. I would say maybe one or two more uh, videos and we should be done. All right. See you guys soon. Bye.